What's up everybody, welcome back to my most anticipated video of the year. This is gonna be my Toyota Camry video for the Magnaflow exhaust. So I waited to do this video for so long now. Uh, this is the first mod I ever got and I really, really liked it. And I always wanna show you guys, but I guess I never really got around to it. For everyone new that's watching, I hope you guys like this video. Um, I've been wanting to do this video for so long and I really, really hope that you guys kinda see how you guys like this exhaust and see if you guys wanna get it. My whole entire channel is based on cars and kind of what my life is. So if you guys like it, make sure to subscribe and hopefully we can reach a thousand soon. Fair and returning, as you can tell, I have a new camera. This quality is so crazy. This is the DJI Auto Pocket 3 and I love it so much. So far, it's been so great. I already shot a few rollers with the Camry and with other cars. So this is awesome. A huge shout out to my friend Vaughn. He hooked it up for me with this product and he told me what to buy and everything. So I'm super excited. I got the creator bundle within this mic and I'm hoping it sounds really, really good compared to what I used previously. I'm gonna cut to the point right now. The exhaust is amazing. It is 100% worth it. If you guys find a used one like I did, it's even more worth it. Uh, the price is a bit steep, around a thousand or so, but it's not bad. It sounds really, really good. And with my car, it has a cold air intake. So it sounds a little bit deeper, a little bit more not as raspy, I'd say, but overall, the sound is the same. So in the future, I will make a video with the cold air intake, or I'll make a video about the cold air intake with the mic in there, but for now, just gonna be for the exhaust. But if you guys like this video, make sure to subscribe. It helps me a lot. Um, this is all for just your guys' benefits. I don't make any mon money off of it, but I enjoy making them. So I'm gonna continue, and hopefully, if you guys like the videos, subscribe, like the video, whatever you guys can. It helps a lot. Thanks. All right, so if you guys saw, we're gonna be shipping out packages today. If you guys don't know, I run the shop Forge Tuners. On there, I sell parts for the Camry and hopefully in the future some other parts, but we're shipping out two packages right now, two lips. And yeah, if you guys wanna support me, that's how I buy my stuff. That's how I kind of afford uh, some of the parts I buy. So I'll have some parts in there if you guys wanna see what's available and hopefully you guys will like it. But enough yapping, I know you guys wanna hear it now. Let's get it all set up and let's go for a drive.
So guys so hopefully you enjoyed that little sequence of me just driving around putting the exhaust on and revving it up so now i'm gonna show you guys what it's like inside the cabin i know that's kind of a problem for people people don't want it to have a lot of drone and stuff so we'll kind of have to see now uh, it's on the settings so i'm gonna do a little bit of driving around and then we'll see if we can get some revving clips but overall hopefully this video has been entertaining so far and hopefully you guys have learned a lot from it and kind of decided if you guys want the exhaust or not I don't know if you can tell because it's a little dark, but I set up this little tripod top of the um, moon roof here. So I'm gonna screw you onto that and then we'll see how it looks on the inside the cabin. Set my heart Considering it's not like a full cut straight pipe, it's pretty good. There's no drone, there's not, it's not too loud, it's not too quiet in my opinion. It's pretty much perfect. Like in my opinion, this is kind of what the perfect exhaust is. The only thing it's missing is maybe like a few pops or burbles or like a turbo. Um, but otherwise, like the sound and everything to me is pretty perfect. It's not too loud, but I know there are some people that like their, their exhaust a little louder. Um, but in my opinion, like I said, I think for for people who own cameras, they know that like, you know, it's only a four cylinder, it's nothing crazy, so it's not gonna be too loud, 
but it's gonna be pretty much perfect. Like I said, this is one of the greatest investments I made. Um, it's a performance mod, but I doubt there's actual performance in it. It's a Camry, guys, at the end of the day, you know, maybe add like two horsepower, making a total of like 207 horsepower that we, that we push uh, with 4,000 pounds, which is basically nothing. But yeah, like I said, this is like the cabin noise. I don't know if the microphone's picking up anything, to be honest, but there really is nothing. But I'm about to go on the highway and see if on the highway, maybe there's some more that I'd ever noticed, but with the microphone, maybe it'll catch on. So uh, we'll, we'll see on the highway. Yeah, so as you can see, like there's literally no drone. Like it's it's pretty good. But yeah, if that's one thing is worried about cabin drone. No, it shouldn't be a problem unless um, the way that you install it or a shop installs it. If you install it too close to the subframe or well, I don't know what it's called. Like whatever it is, if you install it too close underneath the car to the actual body or something. It'll, then it'll like start vibrating the car a lot more and it'll have a little bit of drone. But most people install correctly, you know, it's not too hard. I had done by a shop, I didn't do it myself, so I can't say much, but if you do it yourself, you can always adjust it. If you know how to do it, that's, that's great, you know, so it's not too hard. And like I said, the drone is basically nothing. It's literally nothing, you know, so it is very great exhaust system and I love the way it sounds. I've had this baby now for a little bit over three, four years, I believe, and I love it so much. The exhaust was my first ever mod in it, and it changed the whole way I like this car forever. Everyone loves it whenever they hear it. My friends uh, were all super crazy about it when they first saw it, because they're like, no way a four-cylinder is making that sound. So it's really awesome. I really, really like it. And overall, it was a good mod. Again, like I said, if you guys can, find it on like Facebook for somewhere cheaper. Um, it'd be great. It's a lot better than trying to find it new because I know it's like 1200 1300 new So if you guys can look around take your time no rush in it, you know But hopefully this video has helped you guys decide if you guys like it or not me personally. I love it. My favorite mod ever um, And I highly recommend All right guys, so the sun is setting now So I'm probably gonna end this video. I just want to close it off by saying that I love you guys so much recently These videos have been so fun for me I've just been doing these videos for fun recently and it's been so great. It's like a great stress reliever and I'm going to continue my best to try to do these every single week. I know that it's a bit of work and that I'm going to run out of content soon, but I do that hope I do hope that with time I'll learn to kind of make content kind of out of nothing or just my daily life. Um, for now, I'm going to continue to do what I can, vlogs, tutorials, whatever I can with the videos. I really hope that this video helped you guys out. Whether you decided to actually buy the exhaust or kind of just skip on it, it's okay. Either way, all these mods, they have plenty of mods to do for the Camry, and it's a pretty big platform. If you guys do need parts, I have parts on my Instagram, at Forge Tuners. I'm going to be selling parts for the Camry there and hopefully some other cars in the future. And last, if you guys do like this video, make sure to subscribe and like it. It helps me a lot. It's free, and it makes me feel like people actually watch, watch my videos so that I'll continue in the future. Thanks again, guys, and I'll see you guys next video. Bye!